Welcome back. Temperatures right now sitting at 71. We'll be up around 77 this afternoon. Full sun, sunny tomorrow. Beautiful weekend in the 80s, both Saturday and Sunday. We'll get more clouds next week and maybe a small rain chance by the end of next week. Looks like a great weekend. It's about to start now. That's that right. is all that we have for now. Uh, thank from all of us here at KSAT. Thanks for joining us. That's right. Drum roll, please. SA Live starts right now. From Simba to Anna and Elsa to Winnie the Pooh, all your Disney favorites in an immersive experience unlike any other. We give you a preview. Plus a fun and artsy place to take your kids where you can unleash your inner punk. Oh, that does look mm -hmm. like fun. And six amazing prizes are on the line and someone is winning today. Watch what happens when we spin the KSAT Insider Prize Wheel. It's all today on a very fun Friday edition of SA Live. Celebrate San Antonio. Coming to you live from historic Market Square. This is SA Live. This is the way <laughs> to a happy, fantastic Friday. <laughs> and who wouldn't like some yummy little cookies to go along with this mm -hmm. beautiful day that we have on tap. And a lot on tap on the show today. Good afternoon, everyone. And once again, happy Friday. I'm Mike Osterhage. Yes, I am Jen Tobias Jusky. And for Fiona today, we're talking Women's History Month. That's March. Wow. Yes, right? it is. Isn't that amazing? So we're talking about maybe your favorite women-owned business What's locally. That? Do you have one? I'm going to give a shout out to my neighbor, Gail, because she has Bella Balloons. She's been on our show before, and she does an amazing job. Oh. But we love all of our women-owned businesses, right, that come on? So many that come on. So my two favorites are the ones on today with the great cupcakes <laughs> and also the wine. So. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, shout out to all of them. And just give a shout out to, to a woman-owned business that, that you know, because it's the small businesses that we love having on here and that really make our uh, world go round. Yes, they? exactly. So tag us on Facebook or Twitter at SA Live KSAT. We may share your answers later in the show, maybe even feature them on SA Live, right? That'd all be a good right. idea. Mm -hmm. All right, our first guest is in town here, hoping to add a little magic to your weekend. You might have seen him on the hit TV show, Masters of Illusion. He's also a winner of the Merlin Award for Outstanding Comedy and Magic. Wow. Magician, and should I also say comedian? Yep, but both work for me. <laughs> Which one do you want to put first, comedian, magician? magician uh, let's do comedian. comedy magician. Comedy magician, magician. Eric Eaton is here to give us a little sneak peek of an upcoming performance. Welcome, sir. Good to see you. The Merlin Award, that's like the Oscars, right? Yes, uh, it's for best or best magician of the year and I was able to get one for comedy magic. That's so. amazing. Wow. wow. So okay. some people think I'm funny besides my mom. <laughs> <laughs> well, you have some tricks uh, for us today. We're excited to what see are we what doing? you have. Yeah. Yes. So I figured we'd start off with a card trick. I have a I have a deck of cards here and what we're going to do, Mike? Yeah. Mike, in a deck I have black and red cards, okay? Which one would you like, black or red? Uh, red. Red. And then out of the red cards, which red card would you like? Um, I guess the ace of diamonds. Ace of diamonds. All right, so we're going way up here. So you could have had any one of these cards, correct? You could have had any of these here. You could have had any of these here, including, we even have a joker in here, but you picked the ace of diamonds. Yes. Now, we're going to place that here. I've had a, a card inside my pocket here this whole time. <laughs> would you be amazed if that was your card? Yes. <laughs> I would too, Jen. I would too. <laughs> <laughs> no, we'll place the cards back in here, Jen. And actually, we're actually going to do that. I'm going to place the deck back in my pocket, and there's right. one card. One card, Jen, I wrote down on this card, and it was actually what? the ace. Stop it! Of diamonds. How did you? That never I ceases know. to amaze me. Every time, every time. I, I can let you guys know. Can you keep a secret? Okay. I can, too. <laughs> but I'm bunch. And that's why he's a comedian. <laughs> so you were kind of the class clown, you said, right? Uh, yeah, pr pretty much. Maybe too much. Yeah. You said <laughs> you hey, it's worked to your benefit. Correct, correct, yeah. You helped redecorate the, the principal's office. Yeah, <laughs> we rearranged the furniture. I was there all the time for the jokes. And when it comes to magic, have you just been, since you were a little guy, doing tricks? Uh, yeah, so I grew up, whenever I was seven years old, I saw Chris Angel on TV, and I saw he was doing magic with it to get girls. So I was like, I want to do that. <laughs> Unfortunately, I haven't had the same result, but the magic's going okay. okay I was going to ask, how's it going with that? <laughs> Most girls get scared when you say you want to see a card trick. Yeah. And when you say, don't worry, I'm going to keep in secret. So <laughs> kind of shy off. And your act, which you're kind of um, toning down a little bit, Correct. is yeah, just for, for the, uh, the grown-ups, right? Correct. It's adults-only comedy magic. It's got mature language, um, mature tricks. So mm. basically for jokes that... Oh, us older people, not, not this sure. song, but, <laughs> but this song uh, will understand. Um, <laughs> Ted on camera right there, you just made his day. See how he's <laughs> and the thumbs up. Yeah, yeah that's, uh, just okay. for you, Ted. Just for you. <laughs> okay. What else you got? What, what else you got? So, here, let's let's do another trick. We'll put the cards right. away. 
I don't need these right now. Um, let's do, think of your favorite numbers, both of you. You okay. guys have a favorite number? Yeah. All right, what is, what is your favorite number? 20. 20, okay, and then what is your favorite number? I was gonna say 21. <laughs> 21, do you wanna stick with that or do you wanna change it? It's completely sure. up to you. Tim Duncan, Monty Ginobili. Okay. So, oh, okay. <laughs> 20 and 21. All right, so we're gonna go in here into my phone and I don't want you guys to say I don't do anything sneaky, let me let it read my face. All right, and you said you said 20, so we're gonna go actually to my notes. Um, let's see, right there, there's notes. Mm -hmm. So I was looking at things to do in San Antonio, okay? okay? And so I wrote down a list here. For example, one, there's the Alamo, which, by the way, I've never seen a city so proud of losing a battle. <laughs> <laughs> but, but anyways, we'll go to 20. Okay. Item 20 to do in uh, San Antonio turned out to be SeaWorld. Okay. I want you to remember that, okay, Mike? Okay. Or Jay. Yeah. <laughs> Good memory there, guys. Okay. Glad y'all are on top of it. All right, then we'll go over here. Let's see, where's celebrities? We'll do celebrities. You said 21? Yeah. Who do we have for 21? I can read that. Uh, right, Steve Carell. Steve Carell. Now, there's no possible way I could have known your favorite numbers. You had the option to change your number, correct? Uh huh. You had the option as well right, if yeah. you guys wanted yeah. to change it. Mm -hmm. I have an envelope here. Mm -hmm. I actually sent it in early to the producer, Robert. <sighs> okay. I had Robert sign this envelope. Robert sealed, yes. Yep. Okay, <laughs> right, sealed. All We're right. going to open it up. It's been under this map this whole time. And you guys aren't going to believe this. But somewhere in here, I actually have Steve Carell. It's in here. Okay. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, Steve. What? Corral. But you picked the location, correct? I for did. something to sea do World. here in San Antonio? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Ta -da! Sea World. Oh, I love it. Who did the illustrations? Uh, all, all me. That's <laughs> kindergarten art class finally paid off just what? for this show. Wow. And then, in case that wasn't enough, I actually have a picture of Steve Corral <laughs> at <laughs> Sea World. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh! Okay. Magic! <laughs> if you guys like that, you're gonna love this. Have you all seen where you take the thumb and put it, <laughs> That's and put it back on? <laughs> Uh, okay. The show gets a lot better. Yes. Okay, well, your show, speaking of, we're at LOL Comedy Club. There's still tickets available, right? Correct. Yes, this Sunday we're down to our final tickets. Um, so be sure to get them while you can. They're selling out fast. I think we have tables of four left, and that's about it. We have a couple tables of two, I believe, too. Always a good time. Sunday, 7.30 at the uh, Laugh Out Loud uh, Comedy Club, and we've set up a link on our website, and you can uh, go to SALive.com, click on the As Seen on SA Live tab, or uh, well, we may have a QR code up there. We'll, we'll find one of those for you there. Thank you very much, sir. Appreciate yes, that. So, you. all right. Well, from the magic of Eric, Eric Eaton to <laughs> the magic of Disney. Yes, always a good time here. It's right here, actually, in San Antonio at Lighthouse Art Space. And if you love Disney, you won't want to miss this. Fiona went there with her cute little girl. Take a look. Looking for somewhere to take your little ones for spring break? You can immerse them right here at Lighthouse Art Space in San Antonio. And that's where Disney has taken over. the Disney Animation Immersive Experience. And joining me right now is Disney Animation producer Dorothy McKim. And Dorothy, I mean, this is absolutely incredible. I am so happy to be with you, Fiona. It's so great. And we're so happy that you're here in this Disney Immersive Experience and being surrounded by all, almost all of our films. And this is completely different from a cinematic or an IMAX experience, right? It truly is, it truly is. You know, when we develop our films at Disney, it's all about the worlds and the characters. And that's what this experience is. We wanna pull everybody in and be immersed into our world, into our, with our characters and there's surprises that are happening. We have floor, the floor is activated. We have some bubbles and everybody will just feel like they're truly here. Like in Encanto, you feel like you're in the casita. It's almost 4D at times, you know, yeah. with those bubbles around. And, you know, we have these too, yes, right? Yes, very That's exciting. Yes, and they are, they are 
timed with what we're doing and they will show different colors that represent what is being shown up on the walls. And so how do you choose which feature film, you know, which feature films to kind of show off? Yeah, you know, when we, we began our uh, partnership with Lighthouse Immersive, it, you know, we have high standards at Disney and they have high standards of what they've been doing. And when we came together, we just started talking about what is that theme? Mm -hmm. What is the thing that we could bring? And our films are about hoping and dreaming and wishing. So it was, I wouldn't say that it was totally easy, but it was a very clear vision of what we wanted to do because there was something in every one of those and every one of our films right. that everybody can experience. And speaking of everybody getting to experience it, yeah. that's the beauty and the magic of Disney is it is multi-generational. You know, what moments, what Disney moments are people going to see? You know, that is what is so great. That is something for everybody here in this experience. Whether you saw Cinderella for the first time, whether you saw Encanto for the first time, or Zootopia, or Moana, or uh, Peter Pan, you're gonna remember that moment and we hope that you're going to be here and you're going to laugh and you're going to um, cry and you're gonna jump around and you're gonna run around the floors and have them activated and you're gonna remember that moment when you first saw that film. And for me, Jungle Book is my favorite movie and I remember going to the drive-in theater with my sisters and um, being in that experience. So when I see it, it really brings back those great memories and I love Mowgli so much. I love underdog films, I love them and um, and that film and being in this experience, I feel I'm right there with him. You know, and you mentioned going to that with your sister, and this is an experience for not only siblings, this is families, this is a great date night for couples as well, right? It truly is. And there is something in here for everybody, like I said before, and it is great date night. Mm -hmm. We have a great villain section. <laughs> it's so wonderful. Those delicious villains, they're so wonderful. And yeah, it's just up for, Little children, little babies, we see them jumping around and, 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 our, and our adults. It's so fabulous. And of course, it's here till when? It is here until the end of May. It will be May 29th and we will be here and uh, maybe even hopefully longer. All right, thank you yes. so much. Well, Disney Animation Immersive Experience is now open at Lighthouse Art Space San Antonio. You can find tickets online at lighthouseimmersive.com slash Disney. Wow, cool. I love the flowers with Encanto. That looks so beautiful. I know. So magical, right? Yes. Speaking of. Hey, I just <laughs> want to point out that Eric Eaton, this picture that he pulled out at the end of his uh, act, our producer printed this back at the office before he even got here and brought this with him. So that's how, how yeah. That, how? Yeah. That is the question. That how? makes it even more amazing, <laughs> I, I know, think. So. Exactly. All right. <laughs> Coming up on SA Live, does your weekend involve a little TV time? A popular show is back. How you can turn one hour of TV into an out of this world party. Local Baker is showing us how. That's next on SA Live. Mickey Mouse. Welcome back to SA Live. How do you take your favorite TV show to the next level? This is the way. No, Jen. This is the way. <laughs> <laughs> yes, with some tasty treats, of course. <laughs> Sorry, I missed my line there, right? Okay, Lori Avila McDonald, owner of Addie Bear Sweets, is here to show us some fun, easy designs and even to get more excited for the Mandalorian series, the return of it. Welcome. Yes, um, thank you for having me back. I'm so excited. Your, your two favorite things, baking and the Mandalorian, right? Absolutely. Baby Yoda, like, has my heart. <laughs> <laughs> He's so cute. And I never knew. I thought his name was Baby Yoda. It's... What? It's Grogu. Grogu. <laughs> yes. Okay. All right. So little Grogu, and there's many different ways we can make him. Big, little, all very tasty. How are we starting off with the cupcakes? Okay. So I have some uh, flat top Baby Yoda cupcakes that we're going to be making today. Mm -hmm. So what you do is you start off with a blank cupcake, and you take your buttercream, okay. and then you put just a little bit on it. Just so right in the middle? Yes. Right okay. in the middle. Oh. Maybe like a few seconds, like three, four okay. seconds. Maybe a little bit more, Jen. <laughs> More? All right. Like perfect. That? Yeah, that's perfect, Mike. And then okay. what you do is you'll flip it over on a piece of wax paper, and then you just push it down, and then you'll pop it in the freezer for maybe about five to ten minutes. Just yeah. like that, right? Don't try picking it up right now, because no. then you're, you're <laughs> it's going to be a mess. You're out of luck. And it will turn out just like yes, nice, this Yes, nice flat surface that you can decorate faces or like stencils. Magic. So that's television. a great wow. tip if you say you wanted something nice and flat, like 
fondant, but you didn't have fondant. You mm -hmm. could do this. You yeah. need the big cake. If and you it tastes better. I was going to say that, really but yeah. you said it for me. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> awesome. So then now we can decorate. Yes. So I have some brown um, piping and uh, black. You could do the little eyes. So cute. Okay, oh, so, so you're a huge fan, right? Here. Yes, I love it. It's such a cute show. Okay, and a self-taught baker, right? Yes, ma'am. Tell me how that started. So uh, me and my niece, uh, we saw a few cute ideas on Pinterest one day, and we were just wanting to re recreate it. Um, so we started off with just like a Halloween witch uh, cake, and then when we made it, we saw like so many things that we could improve on. Wow. So after that, it just became like kind of just like getting better and working to improve. And he, he looks like he's got a beard in mind there. <laughs> <laughs> I he's a little guy. <laughs> he might have a beard one day. Hey, babies grow up real quickly Aww. over here. So, and you and your niece together doing this, you then quicker. you named the. Yes, I named it after her, Aww. Addie Bear. Aww. That's what we call her. So, okay, now how do and I do the little ears? So, here? you just take them off the wax paper. So, if you want to make ears at home, you basically just get your melting chocolate and pipe it on wax paper and freeze that. Mm -hmm. And then, when, you're, when they're ready, a, a few minutes later, you can just uh, peel them off and put them on the sides. I keep looking at these ears over here. It's those over there. <laughs> yeah. so, okay. And chocolate. Yes, Ooh. chocolate. <laughs> okay. Nice. Fantastic. Look how cute. And oh. folks can order. Macarons. Okay. It's like that. Do I Look cover, that do I cover the back of it with this Mardi chocolate? Mardi Gras cake. Wow. Yes, yes. Okay. So you can cover that back Whoops. with the chocolate. Okay. And then we've got Easter coming up and all the other holidays. Yes, we and do. And you're going to be playing We have on? a lot of fun pre-sales coming up for all the holidays, uh, Easter and Mother's Day. So they can just go to your website and just look and see what's there? Yes. I'll be offering them um, probably a few weeks before each holiday. If you wanted to order something like a birthday cake or whatever, how far in advance should folks I suggest uh, probably about maybe uh, three Three to four weeks. Okay. About. And depending on how complicated. Yes. So. Definitely. Okay, can I just say these are gorgeous? I know they <laughs> Even are. just like that, but we're going <laughs> to add our you. little ears. Thank you so much. Yes, of course. How, how do they taste? We'll talk about that later. <laughs> if you'd like more information on Andy Bear Sweets, so go to our cute. website, essaylive.com. Click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. <laughs> All right, still ahead. Need a night out with just the grown ups. Yes, Way Rose, one of the newest wine bars in town, is here for a tasting and see what special deal they're offering that's supporting a great cause. And next, want to get a little messy but have a lot of fun this weekend where you and anyone can be an artist. It's our Friday of the Week. It's straight ahead on SA Live. your inner Jackson Pollock. We are here at the new Spin Art Nation and joining me is owner Peter Carollo. All right. Hey. This looks like a whole lot of fun. Tell folks what it is. This is a lot of ideas coming together at once. So with here, they actually go through and choose their canvas size, whatever works best for them. We get them suited up, we give them coveralls and rain boots, and then onto our Spin Art Studio where they get to crank their canvas up to about 45, 50 miles an hour, squirt paint on it, dump paint, blow it around, have a mess, have a good time, make a mess, and then we go through and we clean up everything afterwards and they're left with a one of a kind awesome piece of art they get to take home. Tell me about the setup in there. Absolutely. So we got six different paint stations. Mm -hmm. We got custom tables built and they actually get to strap their canvas in and then as fast as they want to spin it, the more paint flies off and leaves us with some really amazing designs. All right. So folks want to come and try it out. How do they do that? We are working through reservations right now. We're open seven days a week, 10 a.m. to 10 p.m. And all they have to do is just visit our website, spin our artnation.com, click book now, and the rest gets taken care of right through there. They can choose all their packages, extra colors, glitter, they can dry it so that way they don't have to leave it. They can take it home the same day. Okay, I gotta try this out. What do I need to do first? Let's get you suited up. Okay. Let's get some coveralls, because I don't think we want to get that whole covered in paint. Let's get some coveralls, some rain boots, and we'll get you good to go, okay? All right. Okay, Peter, I've got my canvas. It's strapped down, and I've got my paint. We are ready to go. So, so what do I do? Let's start with a good amount of paint, any kind of pattern design that you want, dump it on there. Just perfect. Perfect. Uh -huh. I'm loving it. All right. Okay. Now this is the moment of truth. This is the real fun part where you get to go ahead and spin that as fast as you can and we're going to see how that looks afterwards. Spinning. Faster. Faster, faster, faster. Woo! Very nice. Whoa. Whoa. That's so cool. Look at that. I am loving how that 
that turned oh out. God. You're a natural. So this is our pendulum swing right here. So with this, what I'm uh -huh. gonna recommend, get a whole bunch of paint and put it right up at the front. You don't wanna put anything too far back. Got and it. that way, whenever you're ready, you could either have it spinning or you could have it stationary. I like when it's stationary and that way it doesn't distort it anymore. Okay. And then whenever you're ready, you're just gonna go ahead and let it fall just like that. And, and start. you can go at an angle or you can just let it go and come back like that. I would say white and other colors work really well. Okay. So what I would almost say is get kind of a, a big, uh, larger area of white, so if, okay. you know, white and whatever color you want, and then you'll use this to kind of push that paint around in different directions. Do, and so, I put this anywhere? There, anywhere you want. Now the fun part, got your blower here. All you have to do, pull that trigger. <laughs> Oh, yeah. Now this is gonna push that paint around, give it kind of a watercolor effect. So okay. let it rip, have fun. This is all yours right here. Oh, I know exactly who I'm gonna give this to and who will be so proud to hang it on his wall at home. <laughs> and this is your work of art that you get to bring home and it's yours. All Enjoy. right, thank you so much. For more information on Spin Art Nation, just head to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. Still ahead on SA Live, spring is a great time to refresh your home. We'll tell you about Ashley Furniture's biggest sell ever. But first, it is a grape day to be alive. And we're just not talking wines made out of grapes. There's some other interesting things. We can try special wine tasting this weekend to help support a great cause. That's next on SA Live. You don't have to read first. Oh, sorry. Welcome back. <laughs> Friday and there's a brand new wine bar to, that will make sure you end your week on cloud wine. Cheers. Yes, and cheer, yeah, cheers, cheers to that. Khalil Douglas, owner of Wine to Ten, joins us now with a wonderful, oh, wonderful you. selection. All right, let's just get right to it since Jen is coming steps ahead of us. So, what wines do we have here? What are so, we we're going to start off with the orange wine. Mm -hmm. Never heard of orange wine. Before. Yeah, so orange skin wines it's is good. made in California. Let's mm -hmm. take a little swirl and sip. Oh yes, swirl. Okay. Mm -hmm. So okay, notes. Not, what yeah. are you tasting? Notes of citrus, possibly. Yes, a little bit. Not as orangey as I thought it yes. was going to be. Just we're gonna, notes. Yes. Just then, notes mm -hmm. of it. And then we are eating this oh, yes. with a pepperoni, spicy pepperoni, mm -hmm. to okay. complement mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. If you have food with wine. Do you do like we just did wine first, then the food? Yes. And then take another little sip of oh, the wine. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That really complements mm -hmm. the wine. It's when a great day, you know? <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad I'm here today. How much more of the show do we have to do? <laughs> anyway. I mean, you've only been open for how long? Five weeks. That's it. That's it. Wow. Tell us where you're located. New. So we're off of Babcock and Peru Road. Mm -hmm. Um, very close to the medical center. Cute little neighborhood. Yeah. We're a vibe when you walk in. Why'd you decide to open a little wine bar? Um, Why not? <laughs> yeah. We all love wine, me and my husband. Um, and it's something that we've been dreaming about for a while. We wanted to bring something different to San Antonio. Mm, awesome. And here we I go. I love that. I love that. Okay, well, we're going on to the next yes, one. Yes, so we have Rolling Smoke. And this is a Texas wine. This is right? Texas wine. Okay. Your yes, favorite. this is my favorite out of the bunch. Now, for sometimes amateurs, do you have to swirl the wine? Do you have to? Yes, Mike. So it, <laughs> <laughs> so it is good to swirl the wine, um, but as you see, we do have a wide bowl, so it's giving plenty of air to the wine, but you can swirl it. Give a little smell okay. and definitely taste it. And we're pairing mm. that with a spicy cheese and a pepperoni. Mm. This wine goes great with red meat, barbecue, burgers. Because it's got a lot Risk of it. body to it. to it. Yeah. Yes, it has yes. a lot of body. So let's try it. Mm -hmm. And now I'll take another drink. Mm -hmm. mm. And you just, yep. you don't have any formal mm. training as far as being a sommelier or anything like that. Just, just a lover of wine. Just a lover of wine. Yes. 
Okay. And Which I love, by the way. <laughs> Makes the experience better, right? Yes, we don't want to judge mm -hmm. and, and mm -hmm. be too um, strict on policies on what to do with wine. Wine is very subjective. Yes. Now, a lot of times when, when somebody goes into a, uh, a wine bar or something and they might be a little bit intimidated and just like, I like Chardonnay or I like red, you can kind of coach them through it too, right? Yes, of course. We'll give a little quick one over mm -hmm. as to what you like and kind of what you normally drink and we can help you walk, walk through the menu. This one right here is really good. So I would suggest definitely smelling this mm -hmm. one a lot. You okay. get a lot of uh, floral mm -hmm. notes. It smells mm. wonderful and light. Um, and we're gonna pair that with the Gouda cheese. Would you mm. like one? <laughs> Thank you. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, I'm being very rude. I got to even offer our guests to eat things, so. so sorry. Yeah, it's okay. okay. And then also you said your place mm. is a great one just to kind of, mm. after work, go in, little wine, just a little snack, something mm. like that, a little charcuterie, right? And, yes. And, and some good music too. Yes, oh, so yes. we're gonna have Billy Ray Shepherd tonight and hopefully he'll be a feature at Wine 210. Great saxophone um, player. Great saxophone player, local artist, so we wanna support that as well. And we're excited. And let's let's mention that it's Black Restaurant Week, so you have a deal happening until? Sunday. Can you tell us more about that? Yeah, yeah. so all the proceeds, uh, well some of the proceeds go to um, the SA Food Bank mm -hmm. and partnered by the very own uh, Tim Duncan. He'll He's also matching, matching some, the, some funds. Some yeah, so we're excited about that as well. And then okay. you have an event for Women's History Month as yeah, well. Yeah, so we're doing a wine, uh, women only <laughs> tasting uh -huh. with women winemakers. So that'll be exciting too. So you but, get to feature But some guys can attend too. And you can find those tickets on Eventbrite. Perfect. Eventbrite. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Yes, Thank don't you. forget Black Restaurant Week continues into the end of the week into Sunday. And there's still time to help raise money for the San Antonio Food Bank. For a list of restaurants participating and for more information on Wine 210, you can head to our website, salive.com, and click or click the click the as seen on SA Live tab, or there's a code right there. Get your phone out and scan it, and that'll take you there as well. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, still ahead in SA Live, hundreds of dollars in prizes are up for grabs. Someone is winning today, and you can be next. Find out how you can spin the KSAT Insider Prize Wheel. And next, have you been waiting to get some new furniture? Wait no more, where you can find some incredible deals this weekend and even enter to win a home makeover worth thousands of dollars. You won't want to miss this. You're watching SA Live. your happy space with help from Ashley Furniture. You can do just that this Saturday at Ashley Furniture's largest one day sale ever. You won't want to miss this. here now with Jeff Magner, Vice President of Marketing here at Ashley Furniture. Hello. Hey, how you doing, Jed? Thanks for coming out today. Thanks for having me. This is the biggest one-day sale for Ashley Furniture. What do our viewers need to know? The, this is the biggest one-day sale ever. Yeah, <laughs> ever. so the, the first thing to talk about would be offers, right? So the promotion we're running, 30% off uh, store-wide with no minimum. So no minimum, 30% off store-wide. Or if you want to finance, we got five years. So we're talking five entire years of no interest, but that's also with no minimum and no down payment. So wow. we're going to be really great. Either the financing are the percent off it's going to be an incredible offer sounds amazing lots of deals to be had but also this is a full-on event right absolutely it's a, an event of events <laughs> we've ever done before so starting out the day the first uh, 100 people special gifts for the first hundred people it's gonna be great 150 of the first kids will get child ID kits so we'll have a chance for them to get their child ID kits make their family feel a little bit better mm -hmm. about having that taken care of for their kids on top of that the kids will have face painting we've got carnival bounce houses for that they have a chance to come shoot hoops with the coyote for part of the day what? and you can shoot hoops to actually win uh, more prizes, even tickets to a Spurs game. So wow. a really amazing time. And on top of that, we have a live painting happening with Jack and Beck, local artists here. They're going to come paint mural on our furniture. It's going to be fantastic. We'll actually end up uh, auctioning that off for charity after that. And also, if you like painting, we have some painting workshops that are happening that day as well. Uh, Jenna Roach is coming out, local influencer, to do some styling uh, oh. uh, exhibitions to show how people how to do things for their home a little better. And that'll be happening throughout the day. So many things. I'm yeah. sure I've missed a ton, but it's just <laughs> come on out. It's going to be absolutely amazing. 
amazing. It's always nice to have the styling help too, by the way, yeah, right? Absolutely. And I definitely need all the help we can get. <laughs> yes. And you know if the coyote's coming that it's a big party, right? Big party every time. <laughs> yes. yes. Now there's also, you mentioned some freebies, right, for people, but $5,000 home makeover. Now how can they enter to win that? So yeah, absolutely. So everything is free. We just talked about it. And then on top of that, they have a chance to enter in. Just when they come in the door, there's a QR code. All they do is scan that. They'll be entered to win. No strings attached. Obviously, no purchase necessary to get $5,000 shopping spree for their home. Sounds amazing. Now, I'm looking around here. I see you have some of the traditional living room sets, but I also see here technology has taken over furniture sets as well. Tell me about this one here. Technology has <laughs> certainly come along. So this piece here is actually a power recliner, which is really, really great. It has a slot there. You can put yeah. your phone to charge if you want to automatically that. to be charging up. And then also the headrest itself is something special mm -hmm. here because most people have a, a tendency they want to have a little relief to their neck watching TV. Mm -hmm. This will do that. You just hit the button. It'll move up to your level of your neck. Keep you uh, comfortable for binge watching all night long. Perfect. A lot of great deals and sales. And if you want to come shopping, this is the place to come, especially tomorrow here at Ashley Furniture. The deals start at 9 a.m. They go on until 10 p.m. There will be food trucks, huge savings, and more, as you just heard from Jeff. For more information, you can head over to ashleyfurniture.com or give them a call, 210-249-3400. Thank you, Jeff. Thanks, Jen. Next on SA Live, it's going to be a very happy birthday for one SA Live viewer. Before she blows out her candles, she's spinning the KSAT Insider Prize Wheel for a really big gift. How you can be the next to win. Keep it here. A new month, a new winner. Lots of big prizes are still on the KSAT Insider Prize Wheel, including that $2,500 cruise voucher. Let's meet this month's winner, April Rice from San Antonio. Congratulations, April. Thank you. How long have you been watching KSAT? Uh, since probably over 30 years. Wow. <laughs> since I was a kid. Oh, we love viewers like you. So, And you work in the metal, medical field, right? Yes. What do you do? Yes, I do. I am an RN at Good Shepherd Hospice. Oh, wonderful. And we have to start singing happy birthday for you this month. Big birthday coming up, right? Yes, big birthday. Okay. I've always been told never ask, so I won't. Anyway, have you ever won a big prize before? <laughs> no. Which no one, big prize. Which one would you like to win today? Um, cruising. I like cruising. That would it'd be pretty darn nice. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. Yes, count, it would. count me down here, and I'm going to give it a good hard spin. So go. Three, two, one, spin. Round you go. $2,500 cruise voucher issued by Alamo Travel Group. $2,000 gift card to Living Spaces. $1,000 gift card to Living Spaces. $250 to HEB a gift card and a $100 prepaid gift card. Come on, cruise. Here comes, here comes, here comes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. One more, one more. Yes, you got it. <laughs> <laughs> $2,500 cruise voucher issued by Alamo Travel Group. I think I'm just as excited for you. Congratulations. Oh, wow. Thank you uh, so much. All right. Well, send us a postcard if you go on a cruise, April. I will do that. And again, a big, big thank you, April Rice, for watching SA Live and for being, of course, a KSAT Insider. We're going to spin the KSAT Insider prize wheel for a new winner every first Friday of the month. And you could be next, but you have to be a KSAT Insider. For details on how to enter, just visit the website, ksat.com slash insider. And again, congratulations, April, and happy birthday. Hey, Monday on SA Live Spring Break, of course, is right around the corner. So we're helping you find adventures all week long where you can climb to new heights right in the middle of downtown San Antonio with high flying fun for the whole family. And keep the fun going with some over the top treats, whether you like sweet, sour or spicy. This place has something for everyone. See if we can recreate these edible wonders. My mouth is watering. The adventures start Monday, one o'clock right here on SA Live. Well, right now it is almost spring and of course summer isn't too far behind and you can get a head start on your AC tune up with your local expert John Wayne service company. Take a look. Hi, I'm Jeremy with John Wayne service company and today we're going to be performing an AC tune up for one of our customers. Let's go check it out. Uh, so the first thing we're going to do is go ahead and change the filter for our customer. Uh, this one's been in here approximately a year. 
and it's definitely time for replacement. So next we're going to change out the bulb on the whole home air purification system and then we're going to open the system up and uh, replace the surface sanitization bulb as well. Okay, so now we're done with the bulb, so we're going to move on to the condensation drain. The normal operation of an air conditioner unit does remove humidity out of the home, so that is a normal operation. We just want to make sure the drain is clear. So the inside portion is complete for today. We're going to go ahead and move to the outside and complete the maintenance. Now we're back outside and we're going to go ahead and do the maintenance on the outside unit. We're going to remove the top, make sure all the leaves are clean from the inside out. Um, we're going to wash the condenser coils from the inside out as well. We're going to open up the hood out here and check all the electrical components and make sure that they're functioning proper, properly as well. Well, that's it for today. Once again, I'm Jeremy with John Wayne Service Company, and if you're in need of an AC tune-up, give us a call or visit us at johnwayne.com. Earlier, we asked you to shout out your favorite woman-owned business, especially here locally. We had two right on today. They were amazing. Oh, Elsa. Elsa. Oh, yes. Eye candy boutique, great accessories, fashionable clothes. Yes, we love Elsa. Cake Thieves Bakery, great. Oh gosh, that looks good, Linda. I know, yum. Caroline says Chef Sydney. Yes, shout out to Chef Sydney. There are so many baked SA ceramics and sheer celebrations. Yes. Great choice as well. A round of applause for Robert. David Hurtado, hello. Susanna Franklin, who owns Baker Tatum and Meadow Boutique. It's his go to place for great gifts. And wow, wonderful, wonderful customer service. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend. Take care. We'll see you Monday.